Yep. Dino blow your horn. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, I have not listened to the song since 1980, but I'm back in it because Georgia and I, my daughter, are listen a daughter, I just said it like New York. My daughter and I are jamming this. I'm whistling to it, and she's loving it. You cannot smile. Listening to I've Been Working on the Railroad. If you're having a bad day, I suggest you listen to I've Been Working on the Railroad. Maybe you whistle. Welcome to the show, ladies and gentlemen. Live with Ned, where I literally am passionate about bringing you things, tools, tips, strategies, products, ideas, nuggets to help you live your best life. Welcome to the show. The lighting is insane, but it doesn't matter about the lighting because we're not fancy yet, but maybe one day we'll get fancy. Welcome to the show. Here's what we got today. A couple of things as you go along your way. I apologize, I'm a little late today. I was on daddy duty. Shout out to my wife who's crushing it on her uh, work trip back in the game. But we're holding it down. I'm trying to work on that balance, you know what I'm saying? Everybody, uh, so sorry, that was my mom calling me. Apologies, I'm gonna have to tell my mom to, um, to uh, hold off on the calls while we do the show. Okay, so coffee in red cups. I don't know if it's psychological, but there's something happening here. I have to give credit where credit's due. Yes, Starbucks, love you. However, Tim Hortons, Timmy Hoes, as they call it out here in Michigan, legit, literally, I, 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 I got this coffee yesterday. Well, not this one, but I got the coffee yesterday. I was like, I looked down, I was like, oh my gosh, it's in a red cup. I gotta share it, I gotta give credit where credit's due. Tim Hortons, you're doing a great job. You have nice employees. I'm gonna share a picture showing your employees. Um, this is from this morning. My hair is a little nuts because it's raining here in Michigan, but we're doing it. Welcome to the show. I hope you're having a great Thursday. My goal after you watch these couple of minutes is that you are happier, you're inspired, so let's continue on. Now listen, yes, you got to drink your coffee, but not too much. I got to slow down. I get excited. Let's not drink too much coffee because it's acidic. Balance. Life is balance. So you can counter it with my favorite, some of my favorite tea. I like a lot of tea, but Yogi tea. And it's flu season. Now, you know I'm not fully into flu season. I think we beat up our bodies around the holidays. We're not sleeping. We're stressed. We're running around. We're not getting sleep. We're drinking. So again, to counterbalance Yogi tea, healthy, natural, love it. And again, I love <clears throat> companies with soul. They have these little quotes on here. Let's actually crack this open. Let's crack this open. I just, want you, I just want you to see what you're going to dive into. Nice packaging. I, I'm obsessed with companies who are doing good and are doing it for the right reasons. Those are the kind of companies I'm going to highlight on this show. Companies with soul. Let me just show you like what, why, besides having great product, why I love this company. Like look at this. Okay. Trust is the union of intelligence and integrity. I mean... While I'm like steeping my tea, I'm game. Lemon ginger, just supporting my belly. You know what I'm saying? Digestion. I'm into good living. I want you to live a long life, a happy life. So again, drink your coffee, red cups. It's going to bring you joy. When I drink coffee, I fly. I think you're seeing that. But then I'm countering at night. You know, I'm getting cozy by the fire. You know, again, watching the Hallmark Channel. Just like digesting, you know? Last nugget before you go on your way. People ask me, um, how am I happy a lot of the time? And I actually like thought about it because I, I like to think that I am happy. And I think it's a, it's, it's, it's a multitude of things. I eat right, I keep the right people around me, I exercise, I meditate, I do things that make me happy, I listen to music. But I think at the core of it, at the very core of it, if I had to pinpoint one thing to bring you value, right now, it's attitude. And I know that sounds simple, but attitude is literally everything. I read a book by Ryan Holiday. I'm a huge fan of his, check him out. It's called The Obstacle is the Way. And it stems a lot from stoicism, which basically is not only accepting everything that happens to you, but loving it. And that's gangster. And that is a hard level to attain, but at least if we're on the road to that, it's such a shift. We can't control what happens to us, but we can control how we react to that. I actually want to say this again so I can internalize it and hopefully you can. We cannot control what happens to us, but we can control how we react. 
anything happening in our lives, how quickly can we get back to what can I learn? How can I grow? What can I learn? How can I grow? What's my attitude? So if you're a fourth grader watching this and you're like, I don't want to work with Joey because, you know, he's not nice. Okay, well, maybe that's going to make you more patient. Maybe you're a 70 year old working at a company you don't like, but maybe you can find ways to love it. And you can look back on this chapter and be like, I owned it. I honored it. Attitude is everything. We cannot control what happens to us, but we can control how we respond. We can also drink coffee in red cups. We can also drink yogi tea and have good digestion and fight the cold and flu season with a more natural, natural, uh, with more natural tools. We can also, at, when all is said and done, we can also go in our cars or put in our AirPods or put in any sort of situation to hear music and we can literally play and whistle. I've been working on the railroad. I'm gonna take you out, ladies and gentlemen, live with Ned, sharing tools, tips, strategies, things, products, places to help you live your best life. Let's take it out with a little, I've been working on the railroad. Shout out to Georgia, my daughter, I love you. Megan, I love you. Every time I do this, Georgia smiles. Have an awesome day.